This is Aaron Rice with the Maryland Lecture Group com and we are live we are live on Facebook folks live on Google Plus I want to welcome you to another buyer support workshop we're here every Wednesday 12 noon East Coast time broadcasting from lovely Randallstown Maryland it is a little cloudy today looks like it's about to rain a little bit of rain in the forecast, but uh, that's not going to stop us from sharing with you a lot of great content right here on our Facebook fan page. So if you're not watching us on Facebook, definitely uh, encourage you to uh, check us out at buyermastery.com. Uh, and uh, here's where we're broadcasting live in HD. So uh, again, my name is Aaron Rice. I'm a real estate agent with Keller Williams Select Realtors in Annapolis, Maryland. So I'm very happy to be with you. We are actually broadcasting live on our Facebook fan page. Uh, here's my iPad here to show you we are live uh, broadcasting in HD. And uh, why don't we go ahead and get into our screen share. Got a lot of information to share with you today. So want to make sure that you get it all and we don't leave anything out. We'll be here for about an hour, about 60 minutes or so, uh, sharing with you a lot of great content, a lot of great information. So uh, very happy that you are joining us today. All right, so why don't we get to our screen share. There we go. Let's go ahead and reduce that. There we go. All right, so we should be right on the screen share. Uh, there's a comment section below. Why don't you go ahead and shoot in some comments, say hi. Uh, let me know that you can see the screen okay. Let me know that you can hear me okay. Uh, we had a few audio challenges yesterday on our seller support workshop. Uh, went about 12 minutes before we realized we had no audio, but uh, checking everything here on my end and... Uh, Sounds like we got audio working just fine. So today we're talking about Discover Maryland's top 21 coming soon new home communities. And again, we're live on Facebook, uh, live on mobile. So uh, if you're driving, uh, definitely encourage you to keep two hands on the wheel. Don't watch us and drive, but definitely plug this into your Bluetooth. You can be uh, listening to us while you're driving down the highway. And uh, remember, we do these once a week, 12 noon. Uh, East Coast Time, our live buyer support workshops where we answer your questions uh, in regards to buying a home here in the lovely state of Maryland. So we're talking to first time home buyers, uh, next, home, next home home buyers, uh, if you're buying your second home or a new home, investment property, short sale or bank on foreclosure, this is the place to be every Wednesday at 12 noon, live on Facebook live on YouTube in HD. So welcome. I want to welcome you. This is your first time uh, checking us out online. Definitely want to welcome you to our uh, Hangout and um, glad to know that you're here. Glad to know that you're getting some really good content, really good information. Uh, and so what we talk about on our Hangouts are news and updates, uh, what's happening in the real estate market, live demonstrations. So a little bit later today we'll be uh, going into the website at Maryland Luxury Group dot com and doing a live demonstration so you can find how to find the great deals and we've got live Q&A so again uh, if you do have questions you can just chime into the comment section right below and uh, we'll be monitoring that I'll be monitoring that and answering any questions you have throughout the presentation alright so let's go ahead and get started with our presentation today what you can expect well again uh, the hangout should be around 45 minutes to an hour uh, a little bit extra if we have some questions uh, that we can answer. Uh, the replay, uh, the recorded uh, version of this presentation will be available within five or ten minutes after, uh, after we sign off today. So you'll be able to come back and check that out. And uh, the recording will be available on our YouTube channel as well. So definitely encourage you to uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. So how can you maximize your experience? Well, one way you can do it is increase the resolution by clicking on the gear icon in the bottom right-hand corner of the video. Uh, YouTube has a gear icon. You want to make sure that you're all the way up to uh, 720, 720p, uh, which will be uh, broadcasting live in HD, uh, or 1080p, uh, which will give you even better resolution. So definitely uh, want you to... Uh, uh, step up the resolution there, just click on the gear icon. Uh, realize that you can watch this on any device, whether it's a, a smartphone, um, iPod, iPad, uh, desktop. Uh, you can watch this on any device. If Even if you're walking the dog down the street, uh, you can be listening to us and uh, getting some really good content on buying a home in the lovely state of Maryland. Uh, again, definitely encourage you to chime in, say hi in the comment section below, and uh, know that we are live at buyermastery.com. So, 
I definitely encourage you to uh, uh, like our fan page if you haven't done it already at fb.com forward slash Aaron Rice Helps. Show me some love. Show some love to the Maryland Luxury Group. Show some love to Aaron Rice. Uh, if you like the app and all the support and resources that we offer, please take a minute and give us a five-star review. Uh, if we haven't earned your five-star review, then please uh, send me a private message. Let me know uh, what I can do to earn your five-star review. This is all about you. This is all about providing you with cutting-edge content. We're merging two awesome platforms, Facebook, which is the largest social graph on the planet, and Google Plus and YouTube. So definitely want to make sure that you're getting what you're looking for with our presentation. So who do you know that I should know? Who do you know that's looking to buy their first home, their next home, second home or vacation home, a new home, investment property, short seller bank on foreclosure? I want to know these people. Who do you know that I might be able to help with one of these items? Uh, please uh, let them know about our weekly workshops at buyermastery.com and uh, give them my cell phone number, 443-244-0051. I would love to help them out in the home buying process. So these are the five, excuse me, the eight uh, things that we cover uh, during our weekly broadcasts, our weekly buyer support workshops. After all, our goal is to have you be a pro buyer, not just an average buyer. We don't want average buyers. We want you to be a pro buyer. So we're, solution, we're solving solutions for buying your new home, uh, discovering the path to buyer mastery number one. Uh, we talk about how to avoid the 102 mistakes that most buyers make. And uh, if you're looking for a full list of where those mistakes are that most buyers are making and how to avoid them, most importantly, you can find them at AaronRiceHelps.com is the website where you can find a list of the 102 mistakes that most buyers make and how to avoid them. We're going to cover a few of those mistakes uh, today as we always do. So if this is your first time uh, watching our presentation, uh, you'll be able to get uh, a little snippet of some of the mistakes that are uh, most common uh, to buyers. And then number two, need help finding the right home, coming soon new home communities. We've identified the top 21 coming soon new home communities here in the lovely state of Maryland. So if you're looking to relocate to Maryland or you're looking to uh, uh, get out of your rental and get into a new home or if you're looking to uh, trade in your old home for a new home, we've got what you need right here on this uh, presentation. We'll get into that a little bit later in the presentation. Number three on our list of items that we love to cover is uh, need help with price negotiations and financing options. Well, that's why you're going to want to hire a uh, buyer specialist uh, to work on your behalf. Number four, need help negotiating contract terms and conditions. Number five, need help learning the price of comparable homes for sale. Uh, we're going to do a, a demo on our website where we can show you uh, real-time uh, sold comparables. Uh, this is better than, than some of the other websites that are out there, Zillow and, and Truly and those types of things. I'm going to show you some real-time accurate data directly from the MLS system uh, that you can access uh, free on our website. Okay, and then number six, need help knowing where houses sell in Anne Arundel County. We just completed our uh, Anne Arundel County uh, market trends report and insight into uh, the residential housing market. You can find that report at AnnapolisLuxuryHome.com. Uh, we are nearly complete with the Baltimore County uh, Market Trends Report, so we'll be sharing that uh, next week. Uh, that's my goal is to share that report next week, and uh, you'll be uh, able to get some information about what's happening in Baltimore County uh, so that you can make some good buying decisions there. And then number seven on our list is if you need help stacking down payment and closing cost assistance programs, uh, we've created a website where, you have, where we have all of the different uh, Maryland down payment and closing cost assistance programs. Uh, there's over a hundred of them, and uh, we are uploading them on our website, moveupmaryland.com. And uh, so you'll have access all in one place, uh, brief descriptions of the different incentive programs, how they work, the ins and outs, the benefits, the eligibility, all that information is in one place at moveupmaryland.com. We are going to cover 10 of those incentive programs today. So as you know, or if this is your first time watching, every week we cover a few of the home buyer mistakes, and we cover a few of the different closing costs and incentive programs. So definitely uh, encourage you to stay tuned in for that. And then number eight, we're going to talk about uh, if you need help trading in your old home and moving up to a new home, uh, we've got some systems to be able to help you out with that as well. So a lot of great content for you today. I'm so happy that you tuned in. Uh, well, you might be asking yourself, who is Aaron Rice? You know, what makes him special? Well, I'm a husband, father, grandfather, and all-around nice guy. I'm a sales associate with Keller Williams Select Realtors in Annapolis and owner of the MarylandLuxuryGroup.com. 
My approach takes a critical look at the visions and goals of each client. The combination of my global perspective and youthful mindset provide high-end residential solutions that are repeatable, reliable, relatable, yet edgy and cool. Well, what's different? Well, I see myself as different. I see myself as the proxy for you, for the audience, the consumer advocate, asking your questions. So I'm out in the field and I'm interviewing uh, builder consultants or builders or lenders or title company reps. Um, I see myself as, as, um, as your consumer advocate. I bring authenticity, perspective, transparency, and context to the conversation. My attraction to smart home technology, eco-friendly design trends, outdoor living spaces, tranquility rooms, multi-generational living, and new homes is what makes me just a little bit different than the rest. Who is the Maryland Luxury Group? Well, the Maryland Luxury Group modernizes traditional topics such as demographics of the affluent, lifestyle segmentation, market trends, and amenities in today's luxury new home product. We specialize in custom marketing plans for high-end residential spaces. Talk to me about why you came to this workshop today. What attracted you to this workshop? What do you want to learn today? What are the three things that you could change about this presentation if you could? I want to hear from you. Throw your comments into the comments. Give us some feedback. Uh, definitely want to look for your engagement. Uh, want this to be an interactive workshop. After all, this is just for you. Uh, we're presenting these once a week to be able to answer your questions and to give you uh, access, full access, uh, to an agent with over 14 years of real estate experience. Uh, this is where you can ask all of your questions and get real-time answers to anything and everything real estate related. All right, solutions for buying your new home, discover the path to buyer mastery. Uh, I am a real estate agent, but I'm also a consultant. I really, uh, really specify that. I am a true consultant. As, as your consultant, I'm in a relationship of trust, confidence, and responsibility to you and your family. As your consultant, I take my time to understand your wants and needs and recommend solutions that satisfy those wants and needs for you and your family. As a consultant, I educate clients so that they can make good business decisions moving forward involving real estate. I tell my clients what they need to hear, not just what they want to hear. I like to keep it real uh, with all of my clients. So why don't we go ahead and get into uh, a couple of common mistakes uh, that most buyers make and most importantly how to avoid them. So uh, if this is your first time uh, I encourage you to go back to our archives so you can check out a list of all the uh, home buyer mistakes uh, and how to avoid them. We've got videos at Aaron, AaronRiceHelps.com excuse me that's AaronRiceHelps.com where you can find the 102 mistakes that most buyers make but today I'm going to talk about mistake number 36. Home buyer mistake number 36, not meeting with your realtor to talk about new home costs and financing. You yeah, want to have those conversations with your realtor up front. Uh, that's going to be very important to the success of you and your family when it comes to purchasing a new home. Now, there are builders out there that have what's called everything included. Lennar is, is one of those builders that everything's included. Uh, the only options they have might be a finished basement and maybe a fireplace. Other builders, you know, um, there's a lot of options that you can add into your home, and that can really drive the price up, really drive the price up. Uh, one of the challenges with new homes is when you're driving uh, down the highway or in particular neighborhoods, you see a new home sign. It might say starting at, you know, $499. But when you get into the community, you realize that the homes that are really available start at $489. Um, so you really need to have a, a good conversation a transparent conversation with your realtor talking about new home costs and how you're going to finance it. Uh, are you paying all cash? Are you working with a lender? Uh, are you using FHA financing, conventional financing, uh, construction to perm financing? What type of financing are you going to be using for your new home? So those are going to be some important questions that you're going to want to ask and want to find out so that you are well aware of what's happening. Ooh. Looks like we may have lost our internet connection here. Let's see if we can get back on. All right. All right. Sorry about that, folks. Uh, we lost our internet connection really quickly. So um, hopefully everybody's hearing me okay. Everybody's seeing me okay. And I think we're back online. So uh, just briefly lost our internet connection, but we are back. We are back. Uh, these are live, so you're always uh, susceptible to, you know, Google, Facebook, or the internet going down from time to time. But uh, looks as though we are back online 
and uh, everybody can hear me okay. So uh, very excited about that. All right, so we're talking about uh, home buyer mistake number 37. All right, sorry about that, folks. There we go. All right. We're talking about home buyer mistake number 37, not meeting with your realtor to discuss trust, need, benefit, and urgency. So, you know, you know, the realtor is going to be helping you with the highest asset, the most money you're ever going to spend in your entire life. You got to trust your agent. You really got to trust them. Uh, you got to have discussions about what your family's needs are versus wants. Okay, and then benefit and urgency are also things that you want to be discussing with your agent. This is going to be uh, really important to have these really transparent, upfront uh, conversations. They're confidential, uh, so realize that everything that you discuss with your realtor is confidential. Uh, but you really want to be uh, making sure everybody's on the same page. All right, home buyer mistake number thirty-eight uh, is not doing a walkthrough prior to drywall with your realtor. Yeah, really want to make sure that you're doing your walkthrough prior to drywall with your agent because uh, we know what to look for. Uh, we know if something stands out, something's not correct. Even better than walking through with your realtor is actually walking through with a home inspector. A licensed, certified home inspector uh, can identify some potential challenges uh, with your new home prior to the drywall going up. So definitely encourage you to uh, reach out to your realtor so they can get you in contact with a home inspector to do that pre-drywall walkthrough. All right, so how to avoid 102 mistakes that most buyers make. We're on home buyer mistake number 39, not doing a preliminary in-house walkthrough with your realtor. Definitely want to make sure that you're doing all the walkthroughs with your real estate agent and inspectors uh, throughout the building process. I mean, you've got a pre-construction uh, interview, you've got you know pre-drywall inter inter um, walkthroughs, foundation. Uh, you know a lot of builders because it's a, a dangerous you know active work site. They're not going to let you just kind of walk in the house anytime you want to. But if you can schedule a lot of these walkthroughs, inspections in advance, I definitely encourage you to do so. Uh, you want to do them with your realtor and or your home inspector as well. All right, so we're on home buyer mistake number 40. Uh, buyer never requested a new home orientation checklist from their realtor. Well, if your realtor is a certified new home specialist, uh, they're going to have access to this form. And basically, your new home orientation checklist is going to take you through each and every aspect of the home to make sure that everything that you wanted in your new home is there and it's working properly and you know how to work it and you know how to work it because if you've got a green home with a lot of green features and you don't know how to work them or operate them, there's no point in having uh, spent all that extra money on green features if you're just going to operate it as if it didn't have any green uh, features or amenities. So uh, definitely want to make sure that you're educated on how your new home works and operates. Okay, uh, Home buyer mistake number 42, not reviewing the new home demonstration checklist with your realtor. It's going to be really important. Definitely don't want to uh, skip that, that step. Uh, want to make sure that uh, that everything's demonstrated to you properly. Want to know how everything works uh, throughout the home, um, and uh, you're satisfied with with everything uh, in the property. All right. Home buyer mistake number 43. Uh, never received a punch list from the builder. Definitely want to make sure that you get the punch list from the builder because when you're doing your walkthroughs, uh, you're going to notice some things that are just not you know the way you wanted them. Maybe. Um, some drywall needs to be spackled or uh, there's some paint that's chipping or what have you, uh, you really want to make sure that uh, the builder gives you a checklist of things that uh, maybe there's a dent uh, in, in some of the kitchen appliances and they need to be replaced. So you want to make sure that you do a very detailed walkthrough uh, and make sure that you get a punch list so that you have access to exactly what needs to be repaired, what needs to be tightened up uh, before you take occupancy to the property. So that's our, our brief list of some of the mistakes that, that most buyers are making. And we know that you're not making any, these mistakes, so present company excluded. So we want to make sure uh, that, uh, that you have access to that, you know exactly what's happening uh, with your new home, and you're not making some of these common mistakes, okay? So uh, we're on to the second item on our list, need help finding the right home coming soon new home community. So again, we've really been able to identify uh, the top 21 uh, new home communities and here they are. All right, number one is Magnus Hill. Magnus Hill is a single family home community in Bel Air, Maryland by Ryan. Uh, number two on the list is Evergreen Commons 
uh, Phase 3. That's going to be in Severn uh, by Ryan Holmes. That's in Severn, Maryland. Uh, Davenport, which is a Cahonanian community. It's waterfront townhomes in Essex, Maryland. That's the Davenport community. And the number four on our list is Autumn Overlook. That's going to be in Ellicott City, Maryland, uh, by KB Homes, Autumn Overlook. You can find more information on at autumnoverlook.com. Uh, I created a website just for that community, and we've done a couple of new home reviews uh, for that community as well. Okay, Number five is Windless Run. Those are singles and towns. That's single-family homes and townhomes in Nottingham, Maryland, Baltimore County, just uh, up in the uh, White Marsh area. And that's going to be uh, by Beezer. So that's a new community by Beezer. And then Pooldale Farms is a single-family home community in Eldersburg in Carroll County. And uh, that's by NV Homes, Northern Virginia Homes. Uh, so those will be there in uh, Eldersburg. And then Guilford Overlook is a single-family community in Jessup, Maryland. That builder is Dan Ryan. And Covard Choice are single-family homes in the Forest Hill, uh, Harford County area. Uh, and those are by Lennar. Uh, that's a new community coming soon by Lennar. All right, so those were our top eight. Uh, why don't we get into a few others? We've got Magnus Mill uh, townhomes. Uh, so we've got singles and towns in Bel Air, uh, and that's by Ryan. Uh, and then number 10 is Legacy at the Courtyards at Valley Woods. Those are condos in Marriott'sville in Carroll County, uh, and uh, that's by Ryan. Uh, so definitely uh, encourage you to check those out as well. Ballard Green uh, is a brand new townhome community in Owings Mills, Maryland, right at Lions Mill and Owings Mills Boulevard, right at that intersection. If you go to BallardGreen.com, uh, that'll take you directly to our Facebook fan page that we've created for that community, and uh, you'll be able to get a lot of good information. A couple of new home reviews on Ballard Green are available there, so definitely encourage you to check that out. Uh, and that's by Ryan and Beezer. It's going to be about seven, eight hundred homes there. Brand new elementary school, really nice community, about seven hundred and thirty acres. Uh, of, uh, of new homes there, so that's going to be really nice. Uh, number 12 is Sandy Ridge. Uh, that's going to be in Columbia, Maryland. That's by Richmond American Homes. Uh, number 13 on our list is Legacy at the Enclave at Forest Park. That's a 55 or better community in Elk Ridge, uh, Maryland by Ryan. It's the Summit at Copper Ridge are single-family homes in Davidsonville, and that's going to be another development by NV Homes. And then Bellagio Enclave. These are villas and townhomes in Millersville in Anne Arundel County, uh, and that's another community by Richmond American Homes. Number 16 on our list is the Bluffs at Two Rivers. Uh, that's another 55 or better community in Crofton in Anne Arundel County. That's an NV home, an NV community. Uh, that's for our seasoned adults. And then number 17, Dorset Gardens at Blue Stream. Looks like they're opening up another phase, maybe phase three, uh, there in Elk Ridge, Maryland. Those are townhomes by Lennar. Uh, that's where the everything included is uh, is featured at the Lenar Home Communities. And then uh, number 18 on our list is Taylor Way at Village Crest. Those are elevator townhomes in Ellicott City uh, in Howard County. So those will be really nice. Definitely encourage you to check those out. That's going to be a community by NV Homes. And then number 19 on our list is Centennial Overlook. Uh, those are single-family homes in Ellicott City by Beezer. Um, and then number 20 is Stansfield Estates, single-family homes in Eldersburg in Carroll County. That's a new development by Ryan. And then topping off our list is number 21. Number 21 is Fieldcrest Glen townhomes in Glen Burnie in Anne Arundel County. So that's a community by Ryan. So these are the top 21 coming soon new home communities. You have heard it here first, folks. You heard it here first. Uh, these are uh, communities. They're not in the MLS system yet, so you really can't find too much information on the uh, on the internet. Um, there probably isn't much signage up uh, on these communities, but know that they are coming and coming soon. Definitely encourage you to um, stay plugged in here. Uh, actually, if you jot down a website, it's lifeinthemoment.tv. Lifeinthemoment.tv. That's where we'll be showing all of our. Uh, our new home reviews uh, right on our Facebook fan page. So definitely encourage you to check that out. Lifeinthemoment.tv is where you can find the new home review. So uh, let's talk about uh, getting help finding the right home. Now we've got a, a easy four-step process when it comes to uh, finding 
the home that's right for you and your family. Okay, so phase one is, or step one in our easy four step process is a, a face to face consultation. All right, this is where you and I will sit down at my office, either at my office in Annapolis, I've got an office in Ellicott City, I've got an office in Baltimore City, I've got an office in Towson, Pikesville, uh, Bel Air, Maryland, Upper Marlboro, Maryland. Uh, so we'll find an office that's most convenient for us both. But the first thing we're going to do is sit down and have a face to face conversation. That appointment will probably last about 45 minutes to an hour. I've got a lot of questions I want to ask you just about what you're looking for, your needs, your wants, and um, and so that is, is step one. Step two is we want to get you into contact with a mortgage lender. So depending on the type of home that you're looking for, whether you're looking for a brand new home, uh, we'll get you in contact with a lender that can get you qualified with the Maryland Mortgage Program, a lot of different down payment and closing cost assistance programs. If you're looking to buy a home and renovate it, customize it, uh, and it's not brand new from the ground up, but you want to renovate in an older home, make it nice and new and customized, then we'll get you in contact with a certified renovation specialist, someone that specializes in renovation financing. And if you're looking for a property that's you know, in the jumbo market, anywhere from 700000 or above, we've got lenders who deal with jumbo financing, super jumbo financing, and uh, portfolio financing, uh, all the way up to $8 million, and some above that as well. So it really depends on the type of home that you're looking for, uh, depends on the type of lender that we'll get you in contact with, okay? So step one is uh, meeting with me for a face-to-face -face interview. Step two is, well, I don't like to call it an interview, I like to call it a two-way uh, a two-way interview. You're interviewing me, I'm interviewing you. So step one, sit down and conversate. Step two, get you in contact with a lender. Step three, if you are a first-time home buyer or a buyer returning to the home buying market, we want you to take your pre-purchase uh, education classes uh, with a HUD-approved nonprofit housing education agency. Okay, so that's going to be very important. I have a full list of all the different nonprofit education agencies here in the state of Maryland. So depending on where you live and where you're looking to buy, we'll get you in contact with the appropriate uh, HUD approved agency. Okay, and then step four is once you have your uh, lender letter, your pre approval letter, and you've got your home buyer certificate if you need that, uh, then step four is we go out and start looking at some properties. Okay, so that's kind of our four step. Uh, phase or four phase process making it real easy for you to find the home that you're looking for and um, so why don't we go ahead and get back into our screen share and get back into the presentation so hopefully you found that information uh, helpful and uh, you can pass that on to someone else who you think might need more information about you know what's the process where do I start uh, is a common question where do I start all right, so solutions for buying your new home. What we're going to do is take a quick tour of the website uh, at MarylandLuxuryGroup.com. We're about 30 minutes in, about 28, 30 minutes in. Uh, again, this is going to last probably around 45 minutes to an hour. So uh, definitely encourage you to um, to uh, stay with us. Uh, but right now, why don't we go ahead and do a tour of the website? So let's see. I can get into the appropriate screen. There we go. All right, so you should be seeing uh, the MarylandLuxuryGroup.com uh, website on your screen. Okay, and uh, definitely encourage you to uh, to check us out online. Again, it's MarylandLuxuryGroup.com, and um, these are all the communities that we service on the left hand side: uh, Aberdeen, Akakeek, uh, Burtonsville, Cabin John, uh, Deal, Denton. Uh, Federal Hill, Fells Point, Finksburg. Uh, these are all the communities that we cover in the state of Maryland. Uh, Hyattsville, uh, Laurel, uh, Newmarket, Newburgh, North Potomac, Roland Park, Towson, uh, Whitman, Woodbine, and Woodstock. Okay, so all the communities that we serve are right here on the left hand side. We've got a lot of great uh, video content for you as well. Um, and definitely encourage you to check out a lot of these videos that we have here on the website. A lot of great content. Um, available for you. One thing that I want to show you is the, um, the buy button. Um, so when you click on the buy button, this is where you'll be able to uh, get some information about buying a home in, uh, in, uh, in Maryland. So it looks like you can't see my, my screen here. Why don't I go ahead and see, let's go ahead and apologize about that. Let's get you to the right screen. Uh, there we go. Okay, so uh, now you should be able to see the website. Apologize about that. Um, so we're on the Buy tab on the website. 
And you know, one of the quick ways to get to where I am right here is you can either go to MarylandLuxuryGroup.com or you can uh, go to uh, WeFindRealEstateDeals.com. Either way will bring you to our Buy tab here on the website. Okay. So um, what I want to do just for today is we're going to go ahead and look at just uh, new homes, new construction. Okay. So we'll go ahead and um, just highlight single family and condo. Uh, we'll take out foreclosure, short sale auction we'll go ahead and take that out and uh, we'll put in city we'll do hmm, what do you think what do you think why don't we do uh, Annapolis okay so we found Annapolis Maryland and uh, we're looking for year built so we're looking for new construction so why don't we start from 2013 to 2014 and that's pretty much all the criteria that you need to put in now if you wanted a particular price range you could put in your price range, beds, baths, but I'm going to leave that blank for right now. Just want to show you how easy it is uh, to search for new construction uh, in uh, in Annapolis, in Anne Arundel County. So looks like there's 36 homes that are currently on the market with a realtor, and so you can search by map view. Uh, this is one way to do it: is searching by map view, or you can go back to the standard search uh, by list view. Okay, so this is the map view. This gives you an idea of you know kind of where these properties are located on a map, uh, and then you can do the map two different ways. You can do the road map, you can do the hybrid, uh, whichever you prefer. Okay, so why don't we go back to our uh, list views? Uh, that way we've got it by list, and why don't we arrange it uh, low to high, just so you can get an idea of. Uh, all right, so the least expensive. Uh, uh, the best value in Anne Arundel County is a two-bedroom, one-bath new construction in the city of Annapolis. It's only 194,000, and it does qualify for the Annapolis New Home uh, Program, uh, which is one of the uh, programs that we covered uh, in our uh, past presentation. So, uh, here's a lot of information. This is a, a nice property, uh, 615 South Cherry Grove Avenue. I'm uh, just clicking on that. Just to show you the uh, amount of information that you get here on the website, you've got photos. So if you want to check out all the photos of the home, uh, you can do that. Wow, that looks like a really, really nice property. Very nice property there. So you've got all the photos. And then um, you can even uh, do a payment calculator if you want to uh, check out uh, what the payments would be. The only recommendation that I would make would be to adjust the interest rate. Uh, I'd probably make that right around 4.5%. Interest rate's right around 4 um, but maybe just adjusting that on the high end, that gives you an idea of what your principal interest taxes and insurance are. Um, the only thing left out is just the uh, the taxes. We don't know the taxes because it's new construction quite yet, but looking at payments right around $2,000 a month, give or take. And uh, so every uh, every property does have a payment calculator. You get nearby schools. So that's how you search for homes on the website. If you want to send this to a friend or send it, uh, share it on Facebook, you can do that. Uh, if you want to request more information, you can do that. See a virtual tour, you can do that as well. So a lot of great information there. Now you might be asking yourself, well, what's the lifestyle like in uh, in Annapolis? Uh, you might want to do a tour of uh, of Annapolis. Now the zip code is already plugged in, 21401. So if you just go to the Market Insider tab, that's this blue tab that's already highlighted here. The data on this page is consolidated from multiple sources and includes current listings, recent sales, and much, much more. Whether you're a buyer or seller, the knowledge you'll gain will put you in control of your real estate transaction. So a lot of great information that you can get here. Price trends, sold versus listed, market inventory trends. Uh, this is really going to put you ahead of the game to know exactly what's going on in any particular market at any particular time. So it looks like in Annapolis the median list price is 574,000. Uh, average days on market is 70, or the median days on market is 73. Uh, there's currently a 307 active listings in the zip code, and 6.8% of the listings are distressed. So one of the great things I love about and distressed is you know foreclosure or short sale, uh, if you didn't know. So one of the things that I love is this money sign. If you click on these money signs down at the bottom of the page, this will give you the address and the date of the last sale uh, in that particular area. And then you can zoom on in if you need to. All right. Uh, so a lot of great information right here on the website, right at the uh, uh, Market Insider tab. So I just want to show you a few other things that you can find on the Market Insider tab. You can get community info, and uh, this is where you'll get information about household income, uh, education, highest educational levels obtained, crime risks. Uh, you got all that information there. Weather risks. 
additional stats for Annapolis. Uh, median age is 42, 36% of the couples are married, there's 16,305 homes, and 3,600 homes with children. And then here down at the bottom, this is the part that I love the most, uh, this tells you about the lifestyle, the amenities, where the grocery stores are, where the home stores are, appliance stores, electronics, retail stores, clothing and accessories, malls, departments, wine, liquor, pet stores, restaurants, healthcare, places of worship, everything is right there for you right on the website. So. Uh, looks like I maybe should have logged in. I actually thought I logged in before I started the presentation, but there we are. All right, so um, you will need to set up an account to have access for this information, but it's free. It doesn't cost you anything. But again, here's where you find the restaurants, the bars, clubs, coffee shops, bakeries, desserts, clinics, pharmacies, places of worship, uh, all that's here, uh, attractions, recreation, movie theaters, health care, uh, gyms, spas, beauty, golf courses, and then you've got the address and phone numbers as well right here on the uh, on the website. So a lot of great information here uh, right at uh, MarylandLuxuryGroup.com. So definitely encourage you to check that out. Just a few other things that I want to show you on our quick demo of the website, local schools. Uh, here's a, a good site. Um, because the quality of a school can greatly influence a home's value in an area. On this page, you'll find detailed information on school districts, school ratings, test scores by grade, and student-teacher ratio, and much, much more. So it looks like um, uh, Anne Arundel County Public Schools are ranking 7 out of 10 at greatschools.org, currently 125 schools in Anne Arundel County. Uh, the thing that I love about uh, this page the most is right down here at the bottom uh, is the parent rating. And I like to just kind of play with that a little bit. It looks like uh, West Annapolis Elementary Schools is ranking a five out of five stars uh, with the parents. So that's a, a good tool to have right here on the website. And then if you wanted to compare areas, you could do that as well. So let's say we want to compare Annapolis to uh, 90210 to Beverly Hills. <laughs> you can compare to any zip code in the country, uh, really. So if you're relocating from your current home uh, and you want to know how it compares to uh, to zip code here in Maryland, you can do that right here on our website. Uh, so you've got community stats, you've got community summary, you know, uh, comparison between median age, married couples, number of households, market stability, if you want to compare that. Uh, if you want to compare schools, uh, you can do that as well. If you want to compare price trends, sold versus listed, uh, you can do that between two communities. You can compare market inventory trends as well. All that right here on the website. Property ownership percentages, the percentage of vacant properties versus rented properties in a particular area. Now, my real estate investors love this fair market rents tab because this tells you what the uh, average rents are, studios, one bedrooms, two bedrooms, three bedrooms, and four bedrooms, and you can compare them uh, between zip codes as well. Uh, you can also compare income by household uh, as well between two zip codes, uh, crime risk, uh, education levels of pain, weather risk, smoking bans. All that's right here on the website, MarylandLuxuryGroup.com, and hopefully uh, you knew this was here already, and this is just a review, but if you're, this is your first time watching and you didn't know all this information was here, now you got it. Now you got access to it. All right. So, yes, it is here at MarylandLuxuryGroup.com. Okay. So, why don't we go ahead and get back into our presentation, our screen share, and... Uh, all right, so that's the quick tour of the website, and uh, a lot of great content there. All right, let me go ahead and get into our screen. So there we go. All right, so we are back on the uh, on the screen share here, going back into our presentation. All right, so let's check our time. Uh, it's about twelve forty, so we've got a few more minutes. Oops, let's see. Uh, let's get back into the screen share here. All right. There we go. Okay, so uh, let's uh, recap. Let's uh, talk about what we covered uh, in today's presentation so far. We talked about uh, how to avoid uh, some mistakes that are most common with buyers. Uh, we also talked about uh, if you need help finding the right home. We talked about the uh, top 21 coming soon new home communities in the state of Maryland. So we covered that as well. We also talked about uh, needing help with price negotiations and financing options. Uh, we also talked about, uh, well, we haven't talked about negotiating contract terms and conditions. 
Uh, I showed you where to find uh, the price of comparable homes. We did that right on the website uh, just a few minutes ago. Uh, and I also showed you where to get information about uh, uh, if you're looking to move to Anne Arundel County, uh, the Market Trends Report, AnnapolisLuxuryHome.com is where you can download the 43-page uh, report uh, about where houses are selling in Anne Arundel County. So why don't we go on to number seven, uh, need help stacking down payment and closing cost assistance programs. Uh, remember, you can find more detailed information at MoveUpMaryland.com. Ooh, just doing a lot of talking, needed to grab a swig of water. So MoveUpMaryland.com is uh, where you can find the down payment and closing cost assistance programs. Uh, I'm going to cover a few of them with you now. Remember, there's over a hundred different down payment and closing cost assistance programs in the state of Maryland. MoveUpMaryland.com is the one place where you can find information about program overviews, property eligibility requirements, benefit details, loan and grant terms, and much, much more. You'll have access to all hundred different down payment and closing cost assistance programs. Uh, it's only $15. We've created videos for each one of these. The videos are anywhere from two to seven minutes long, uh, depending on the assistance program. And I definitely encourage you to tune in to moveupmaryland.com to have access to that. So uh, if this is your first time here uh, uh, checking out our uh, buyer workshop, we cover 10 of the incentive programs once a week. Just giving you a really quick snippet of uh, what the program's about, and um, so why don't we get into number 21. Buying into Baltimore fairs and trolley tours, uh, there's $5,000 in incentives, and a lot of these can be stacked. Uh, we call it stacking incentive programs. So uh, I am what, what's called a stack master. I, be I believe in uh, stacking a lot of these incentive programs on top of any programs that you might get with a builder. You know, builders are offering anywhere from ten dollars to $25,000 in, in, uh, in closing cost assistance, uh, we can help you with uh, stacking that with some other programs that are available throughout the state of Maryland, depending on where exactly you're buying your, your new home. So let's get it back into the buying into Baltimore fairs and trolley tours, $5,000 in incentives, a program for first-time home buyers who have not owned a principal residence in the last three years who are purchasing a home in Baltimore City. Uh, the next trolley tour is September 27th. September 27th, you can go to Live Baltimore, L-I-V-E, LiveBaltimore.com for more information about that trolley tour. Number 22, 22 is a CECL Closing Cost Assistance Program, otherwise known as CCAP. Uh, it's a loan of up to $10,000 for eligible home buyers towards settlement expenses, including down payment, closing costs, and prepaids. Must be a principal residence in Cecil County. Uh, the application fee is only $500, and the sales price cannot exceed $346,601. The Chase Dreammaker Opportunity Program. So that's by Chase Home Finance, J.P. Morgan Chase, a flexible mortgage product geared to borrowers uh, up to 100% of the area median, median income. So there are income requirements for this program, and these are 15 and 30-year fixed rate and arms that are available. Min minimum credit score uh, needs to be 640. 640. <laughs> so that's a great program. Uh, the City of Rockville Real Estate Effort Affordable Community Housing, otherwise known as REACH. Uh, that assists first-time home buyers who can afford a mortgage uh, paying and overcoming uh, barriers represented by upfront expenses. So $12,000 towards down payment and closing costs for that particular incentive program. Pretty nice. Let's keep it pretty nice. College Park New Neighbors Program for Police and City Employees. That's a 7,500 grant to encourage the con conversion of single-family rental properties to owner-occupied housing. And that's for City of College Park residents only. Right. Yep, yep, that's right. That's a nice program. Number 26 is the Cumberland Family Asset Development Program designed to assist low-income families and individuals to save for the purposes of buying a home. Starting a fresh, excuse me, starting a business or getting education. So this uh, uh, is a loan for buying a home, starting a business, or continuing your education. And this is for residents of Cumberland, Maryland. Uh, and for every thousand dollars saved, F and M Bank will match it uh, with eighteen hundred and seventy-five dollars. So that's pretty nice. All right, number seven, incentive number seven, the Cumberland Historic Tax Incentive facilitated by the Cumberland Historic 
Preservation Commission. It's a tax incentive for owner occupants, and you must live in the city of Cumberland. Okay? That's another nice incentive program. Number 28 is the Delta Sigma Theta Closing Cost Assistance Program. That's $1,500 towards down payment and closing costs. Must be an owner occupied property. So, big shout out to all the Deltas out there. Awesome program to help first time home buyers. And then, number 29 is the Down Payment and Settlement, Ex Settlement Expense Loan Program, otherwise known as DSELP. Uh, this is $5,000 for down payment and closing cost assistance in conjunction with a CDA loan. Okay. Uh, and then number 30 is the Emergency Housing Rehabilitation Revolving Loan Program. This is for Frederick County residents, Frederick County homeowners. This is Frederick, uh, facilitated by the Frederick County Department of Housing and Community Development. Provides loans at 0% interest uh, for making emergency repairs and repayment. Loans may be deferred for income eligible Frederick County homeowners. Pretty, pretty nice, folks. A lot of different incentive programs here in the state of Maryland. I want to make sure that you know all about them. All right, so let's uh, round out today's uh, broadcast with number eight, need help trading in your old home and moving up to a new home. That's right. We've got a program exactly just for you. It's called our Maryland Trade-In Program. You can find more information at MarylandTradeIn.com. And this is where we uh, show you ways that you can trade in your old home and move up to a new home. So if you currently own a home and you want to trade in your old home and buy something new, uh, sellers, you now have more options to cover every situation. Well, we've got a pool of investors that will, you know, uh, if you have sufficient equity in your home for a percentage discount, we've got investors that will pay all cash for your home. Uh, so that you can sell it pretty quickly. Uh, if you're looking to do a conventional retail sale, uh, what we'll do is we'll discount our professional fee, which will enable you to net thousands more uh, for you in your pocket. If you're uh, close to having negative or no equity in your current property, we can talk to you about our three-year leasing program. If you're a renter and you're watching this, uh, you also might want to know about our lease buyout program for renters, where we'll actually buy out your lease and show you systems on how to buy out your lease so that you can actually move up to a new home. If you're watching this uh, hangout and you happen to be from out of state and you're looking to relocate to Maryland, uh, we've got 700 Keller Williams offices nationwide. We can definitely get you into relationship with a Keller Williams agent in your area that can help you uh, with these systems and these strategies to get your home sold so that you can uh, move into a new home here in the lovely state of Maryland. And then we've also got a second chance lending program uh, if you've been turned down by your lender, we've got lenders that operate outside of Fannie and Freddie guidelines that can get you into a new home. All right, so we work with a spec home or a, a custom build job, and we can work with a 60 to 90 day closing. So we can uh, work our systems pretty quickly. Uh, the reason we can do that is we've got specialized knowledge and skill. Uh, I am a certified distressed property expert, certified investor agent specialist, certified luxury home marketing specialist, certified new home sales professional with the National Association of Home Builders, certified new home specialist, certified residential specialist, internet marketing specialist, graduate of the Realtor Institute, residential construction certified resort second home property specialist, senior housing specialist, and I'm honored to be a member of the Veterans Association of Real Estate Professionals. Been a realtor for about 14 years, got another 16 years to go. So our objective is to set an appointment the same day you call in uh, looking for options to trade in your old home or trade in your rental. Uh, we want to set an appointment and be sitting at your kitchen table within 48 hours. Okay, so we're looking to move uh, pretty fast. We're available to move fast. That doesn't mean we want to push you into making a decision. Uh, we just uh, want to make sure that you know that we're on top of it and uh, we're ready and willing to meet with you at a moment's notice. Our track record for success, the top 10 secrets for our success with this program. Number one is our pre-listing appraisal program, which assures your home is priced right. Number two is our pre-listing home inspection program, which assures uh, that there's no surprises. Uh, the only time I like surprises is on my birthday. That's November 19th. That's the one time of the year that I like surprises, not at any other time. All right, want to present surprises, all right? So our pre-listing title work program assures that clear title can be conveyed to the end buyer. Our pre-listing home warranty program assures that all major systems are covered during the listing period and uh, that home warranty will convey to the new buyer for a full year. Uh, and we give that to them as a gift, as a moving in gift, 
uh, we get that pre uh, or get that home warranty program conveyed to them. Our in-house staging professional will stage the interior and exterior home so that it looks beautifully. Uh, 30 professional photographs will best position your home in the MLS system. Number seven, custom Facebook fan pages. We do custom Facebook fan pages uh, for each one of our listings um, and uh, this really positions your home in the largest social graph on the planet. Number eight, uh, our custom tracking program will identify internet hits from over 370 different aggregate websites. Number nine, we provide our sellers with weekly status grams to track agent showings and buyer feedback. If you want to see a sample of our status gram and a sample of our marketing plan, definitely encourage you to uh, go to MarylandLuxurySolutions.com or you can go to sellermastery.com. Either one uh, will take you to yesterday's live seller support workshop where you can see a bit of our, uh, our uh, marketing plan, which we have there. And then number 10, our global exposure, local expertise in Maryland Reach assures maximum marketing coverage for your home. Extended global marketing reach. When sellers list with us, they'll have access to the Keller Williams listing system, otherwise known as KWLS. This is a proprietary system exclusive system that ensures their property is marketed online 24-7 through more than 370 of the most popular websites in 86 countries in their native language. Our extended global reach leads, uh, goes to List Hub Global, which provides brokers the opportunity to market their listings in the international marketplace with the same data uh, protections and manage listing distribution platforms available through List Hub today. All right, so we're talking about building your dream home. And uh, do you have a home that you need to sell? Do you have a home that you need to sell? Um, we have a free contingency analysis. And I definitely encourage you to check out the Maryland Trade-In program uh, at MarylandTradeIn.com. And uh, definitely check that out if you're looking to build your dream home. The top five questions that home sellers want to know. What are the top five questions that most home sellers want to know? Well, number one, how much is my home worth in today's market? How much is my home worth in today's market is question number one. Uh, number two is how are short sales and foreclosures affecting our home's value? Well, that's going to be a critical question, especially considering in the state of Maryland uh, that uh, we are number two on the foreclosure list, meaning foreclosure filings. Uh, Maryland is unfortunately fighting Florida for that number one spot in the nation for foreclosure filings. So that is definitely having an effect on home values. And so I often get that question, how are short sales and foreclosures affecting the value of my home? Question number three, uh, what do we do if we have negative or no equity in our home but still want to buy? Well, we've got systems and strategies to be able to help you with that. One of those is our three-year leasing program. Number three, is now the right time to invest in a new home? And then number four, what are my options? Well, again, at MarylandTradeIn.com, we've uh, really come up with three options to really be able to assist you in trading in your old home and or rental into a new home. Number one is an equity sale. You can use your equity for the down payment on your new home. Uh, we work with investors who will purchase your home at a discount and pay all cash. The benefit is they can close quickly and you can even rent back your home at fair market value until your new home is built. Option number two is our reduced professional fee. If you're really close to being uh, in a negative equity or break even position, we will be more than happy to reduce our professional fee, uh, sell your home for top dollar on the open market, give you, give you a discount of professional fee so you can maximize your profit. We do this because the new home builder will help offset your professional fee because of our past performance, performance with that builder. We also have our three-year leasing program. If you have little or negative equity but still want to buy a new home, our three-year leasing program may be your solution. We'll assist you in setting up a lease to own option on your current home, for up to three years, you can make more money by holding your home and selling it in the future. So those are our three options that we have for people looking at trading their old home for a new home. Definitely encourage you to contact me today for a free, no obligation, contingency analysis. So as we close out our presentation for the day, uh, definitely encourage you to uh, like our fan page. If you haven't done that already, uh, definitely go ahead and give us a like. Uh, and uh, what you want to do is actually hover over the like button and then you can click on the get notifications tab. Uh, that way you'll get new posts, new updates. Definitely encourage you to uh, invite a friend to our next week's uh, live seller support workshops. We do them every Tuesday 
at 12 noon at sellermastery.com. So that's where we answer all the seller questions when it comes to selling your home in the state of Maryland. And then I uh, definitely encourage you to invite a friend to next week's buyer support workshop at buyermastery.com every every uh, Wednesday at uh, 12 noon here in, uh, in the lovely state of Maryland, East Coast uh, time. Okay, and then also don't uh, want you to forget that uh, this broadcast will be recorded, so you'll be able to watch the recording in about five or ten minutes. Also, want to let you know about uh, new home reviews. We do those at uh, lifeinthemoment.tv. And if you need to reach me, uh, you can give me a call directly at uh, 443 244 0051, or you can text me to that same number. So look forward to uh, seeing you next week. Same bad channel, same bad time. This is Aaron Rice with the Maryland Luxury Group signing out.